turning our attention now to Walker County, where backlash continues to grow after the death of an inmate. Now, taking you back to the beginning, Anthony Mitchell was arrested on January 12th after the Walker County Sheriff's Office says he fired at officers during a welfare check. Afterwards, Mitchell's family says that he would allegedly spend two weeks in a holding cell and was possibly placed in a freezer. Now, he later died on January 26th. No cause of death has been made public just yet. The family has now filed a federal lawsuit in Mitchell's death after the video came to light showing two officers carrying him to a car. Now, the officer who had this footage has since been fired from the department. The state and the FBI have now entered the investigation into his death. In a statement from a lawyer for the department, they expressed condolences to Mitchell's family. Now, no further comment has been issued by the department or Sheriff Nick Smith, who was cited alongside 10 correctional officers in the suit. Attorneys say additional comments will be made once the investigation is complete. Now, the incident at the jail has sparked protests within the community, and that's where we find WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough this afternoon. Chip, are people still demanding more transparency? Oh, they sure are, Jarvis. In fact, several dozen people gathered outside of the Walker County Courthouse here in downtown Jasper this afternoon to continue their push for answers. Take a look at this video we shot about 3 o'clock this afternoon. This is certainly the largest protest we've seen so far since we've been reporting on the death of Tony Mitchell. Family, friends, and complete strangers say they want to see justice in this case. And we saw many signs this afternoon reading, Justice for Tony Mitchell. Those in attendance say they're glad to hear the FBI has now joined the investigation. There's so much negativity about the South in general, and this paints our community in such a bad light. And I think when you look here and you look at all these people who are here supporting each other, people who showed up to protest in the middle of the night, who, who had no even direct connection to, to Anthony Mitchell, it, it shows that we, we, we believe that there's something that can happen differently here, that a different world is possible and a different Walker County is possible. And a man who identified himself as a family member of someone who works inside of the jail approached me off camera this afternoon, asking me to let all of you know that he says it's been very difficult for those who work inside of the jail to report to work every day while this has been going on. Live in downtown Jasper at the Walker County Courthouse, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13.